Okay, so we want to create a add button here that we can press to then take us to a new page which allows us to create a new task. Okay, so let's go to our Angular code and let's start creating this button. Okay, so within this task list container at the end, we can uh, create a button with the class of um, circle add button. And we can create this button in the styles, in the style sheet. So let's go to the bottom here and let's create circle add button. Okay, so here what we can do is we can set the height <clears throat> to 50 pixels, the width to 50 pixels, the background to primary, and um, we're going to set this actually as position absolute and save this now. And now we have this button show up here which isn't in the ideal location, right? So we want this button to show up down here, not up there. So the way we do that is we're going to go to our code and we're gonna set the bottom property to zero. Save that and let's see what happens. Okay, so now it's right at the bottom here. Um, and now we want to set the right property to zero. So let's set right to zero as well. So now it's down here. But the thing is, is that we want it within the confines of this task container. So what we have to do is we have to set the position of this task container to position relative. So let's try that now. So let's go to the task container, the task list container, and let's set the position to relative. Save that. And there we go. So now we have this button being in the confines of this task container which is brilliant. Okay, so now what we wanna do is we wanna um, make it so that it's not attached to the edge. So let's go to the circle button styling and let's, instead of having it zero, let's say uh, 25 pixels. So let's set the bottom and right to 25 pixels. So now it's 25 pixels away from the border, from the edge. So now let's make that a bit more. So let's increase that a bit more to 35 pixels. Save that. And that looks a lot better. There we go. And now what we want to do is we actually want to add the button class to this so that uh, we get some button styling. So let's go to taskviewconfront.html and let's add the button class, which is a BOMA class, which will um, make it look like a button for us. There we go. So now it looks more like a button. Uh, but we want to remove the outline. So let's do that in our custom styles in the style sheet. Let's remove the border. So let's set border to none. There we go. Okay, there we go. And actually, we can remove this background primary and we can instead put is primary, the class is primary here. Save that. And now we have a nice button. A very very nice button here and actually because we have is primary we don't actually need the border none because I think that's set automatically in is primary so let's save that okay perfect so now we have this very nice square button here but the idea was to make it a circle so let's make this a circle so let's set the border radius to 50% save that and now we get this circle so that looks pretty good okay Okay, so what we want to do now is we want to add a plus icon inside here. I've created a plus icon um, and saved it as an SVG here. And I'm going to put this in my project. So let's go to the Angular project. And you'll see that there's a folder called Assets. So in here, I'm going to copy and paste. Let's copy this file here and let's paste it into Assets. Okay, we can't paste apparently. Um, Let's um, reveal it in Explorer and go to Assets and we can paste it here. So we've just pasted the plus icon in here. Great. Yeah, okay, so that's the SVG code. It's pretty basic. It's just of a plus icon. All right, so now we have this plus icon here. So now what we can do is we can go to the template and we can add an image tag in here. And 
we can set the source to um, assets plus icon.svg. Let's see what happens when we save this and go to our app. All right, so we now have this nice circular add icon. That looks pretty good. Now we have to create the new task page. And when this button is clicked, it then takes us to that page. So let's start doing that. 